Hi, this is Lady in the Garden. We've got a forest fire headed this way. We already got uh, notices that we may be asked to evacuate. But I'm not leaving. I'm not going anywhere until they actually tell me I have to. Uh, we're going to hit a record high probably of about 111 today by 3 o'clock. Uh, so you can see... My plants are not liking it. Some of the tomatoes, depending on what variety they are, they will turn brown a little. Some of them may even die because of the heat. Some of them will survive till the weather cools off. And then they'll produce more tomatoes at the end of the summer. That's why I baby them right now. I keep them watered. Everything is struggling right now because it's almost three, so, you know, it's almost at the high temperature of today. My clematis, still growing like crazy. It came up again from last year, but it's even struggling, too. I keep it watered as much as possible. Don't want to water it in the middle of the day like it is right now because it's too hot. But you can see... I've got uh, little tomatoes still producing. It's just too hot for most of them to do anything. I've got peppermint growing, collards or kale, peppers. I've got hot peppers and bell peppers growing. Starts cooling off a little bit. These plants will take off if they do survive this heat can see that tomato plant right there is just really struggling. I do produce, well, you know, I do my own compost when I don't have a tub to fill up or a big pot. I use this compost bin right here because you can fill it up. I'm not very good with this camera. You can fill it up with compost, keep it wet, and then turn it. And that's a lot easier for me than the way I was doing it before with this little uh, compost pile. I'll still use that, though, if I fill up the compost bin and I don't have tubs to fill up. I'll just pile it in here until I'm ready to use it. I don't waste anything that'll turn into soil. Now that uh, brandy wine cherry tomato, it's really struggling in this heat. But if I can keep that thing living, it'll it'll produce a lot more tomatoes. I mean, it's got green tomatoes on here right now. You can see right there. So they will still produce in the heat if you keep them watered. Right there. I have to keep my uh, videos down to a minimum because I can't upload them if they're too big. So I'm going to sign off for today. Try to stay cool. Get in the house where it's cooler than out here. And don't forget to eat what you grow. Talk to you later.